In this Hindenburg tutorial, we're going to look at link tracks. And in this tutorial, we're going to look at how you can use link tracks to edit an interview that has been recorded in stereo. So in this case, we have a interview. It's been recorded in stereo. We can see the dark waveforms and the lighter blue waveforms indicating there is something in left and right channel separated. What we can do now is separate this stereo file into a left and right channel. The way to do that is to highlight the region, go into the Tools menu and choose Split Stereo. Now we have a region that is separated into a left and a right track. We could now edit the track separately, but what we would like to do is edit them together. To do that, we need to link the tracks together. So now we highlight by holding Shift, Track 1 and Track 2. We can now right click on the track and choose Link Tracks. When we make a selection, we're making the selection on both tracks. If we choose to split a region, so we're separating the region, we're doing it on both tracks in one go. We could also edit on both tracks at the same time. So we could clear this region or cut it. Other things that we can do while the tracks are linked are trimming a region, fading a region, and even crossfading a region. In this situation here, we have overlapping audio, and we would like to mute the audio on one of the tracks. A way to do that is to split the regions. We can now highlight the one region that we want to mute. Press Command M on a Mac or Control M on a Windows machine or go to the edit menu and choose mute. It's one of the goals. <laughs> Simone and Kipsky put a lot of that humor into their music videos as well. Take the video for this track. So. Editing with link tracks.